Welcome to Shwara Robert speaking. How may I help you this evening? Robert, how are you doing? Uh, sorry, just to, just to let you know, I just, my phone records uh, phone calls, so I'm recording this. I'm hoping that's okay with you. Um, you're recording the phone call, is it? Yeah. Well, you're recording the phone call, so... Yeah, yeah. no problem. Yeah, that's absolutely fine. Cool, nice one. Listen, I just have a couple of questions here. I'm, I'm trying to work out... You see, I'm, I'm a bit beleaguered by, by all the information that's coming at me via, I don't know, Facebook and... and, and, um, and the journal.ie and Irish Times and all that kind of stuff. So I have a couple of questions. Um, yeah, no problem. No, that's why I'm here to help with your search there for. Come on. These are all the questions I'm being asked, by the way. So I'm just passing the question on to you in, in the hope that you can enlighten me. Yeah, no problem. And in what capacity would you be asked these questions, sir? Are, are you working on behalf of uh, local authority, or mm -hmm. am I asking? Sorry, no, no, I can clarify it very much. Sorry, my name is Rory. Um, no, no, I, 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 I'm self-employed, so I, I, I'd be calling to houses, um, well, doing the domestic appliance repairs, etc. Um, okay. But I'm always asked about, you know, is it, is it a problem with the water? Is it pressure? Did, 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 and kind of stuff. And it got me thinking about the whole thing. And I'm wondering that if I decide to just kind of get my information pack and just send it back to you, say, return to send or no contract, sorry, I, I'm not interested in this, that what happens next? And I can't, I can't see how I can be compelled to pay. The money can't be taken as source because it's not a tax, it's a charge. And you can't cut me off. So why, why would I pay this charge? That's my confusion. Do you understand? Know I understand your confusion, sir, and you're welcome mm. to register the question. Um, but uh, um, just as I was saying before, we, we don't actually have a procedure outlined as to what will actually happen in this instance uh, should you choose not to pay your bill. Um, if you choose not to pay your bill, that is your own choice, of course. Um, yeah. You know, you, it's, it's, it's your own choice to do, to do um, with what, as you please, uh, your own disposable income. Um, but just to kind of give you a bit of a bit of feedback on what sure. the actual situation is with our water at this moment in time. I mean, generally there is an ethos going forward that we'd like to kind of have some kind of cleaner, safer water system in place. A yeah. lot of the actual piping system that is in the ground at this moment in time, I am aware from my training with Irish Water, mm -hmm. that it actually is quite dated, um, and, and a lot of the actual infrastructure that is in place is something that will need to be addressed in the, in the not too distant future going forward, because a lot of it is, is kind of wasting away to kind of next or nothing, yeah. um, and this is something that the actual revenue generated from the water services is something that is going to be going, going towards in the future, you know. Um, so, as regards to an update of the system, uh, the infrastructure itself, this is all something that is going to be looked at um, and is part of the, the Irish Water ethos going forward. Uh, I know you did say at your own property that you are um, using safer water methods as regards to um, collecting, or sorry, um, more efficient water uh, usage by collecting and gathering rainwater and stuff like that to service mm -hmm. your, uh, your sister in the attic to supply maybe something like your, your toilets and yeah, stuff yeah. like that. That, yeah. is a very, that is a very, very uh, wise thing to do mm -hmm. going forward. That is, that is also something that Irish Water are looking to promote in their ethos going forward. So as such, they're not trying to actually charge people for water. They are also trying to promote the fact that people are, um, they want people to use water a bit more kind of um, sensibly, I suppose, as sure. such as what you'd say. Um, because going forward, um, our kids um, and our future generation, this is something that we'd like to promote for them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, water is a natural resource, um, and it's something that that they want to preserve, uh, not only for now but also into the future. So, when you do pay your bill with Irish Water, mm -hmm. you can trust that it is going to to better better serve the future population. Um, maybe you have children or grandchildren yourself, um, but generally the main kind of topic that they want to address is going forward the infrastructure that is quite dated and may cause problems in the future for people and um, so we'll say even something like a bursted pipe or something like that yeah. you know you were mentioning there that you might have an issue with something like that going forward Irish Water will be in a position that they'd have to fix that for you going forward like you know yeah and um, so when you do pay your bill and stuff like that then your money is going to going to be better served um in the future and um, for things like that you know
right, right. Or things like a, a pipe and stuff like that may, may, might need to be replaced or something that needs to be updated in your state that better serves you and your neighbours. That is that is where the money actually goes to. So, I mean, if you do choose not to pay the bill yourself, it's yeah. your own choice. Um, obviously, certainly it's your own disposable income. You can do with it as you please to do so. But you do know that when you do pay it, it is going to something uh, like a better cause, such as water or water um safety as well as also uh sanitation of the water that you're actually receiving in your house i know you said you might use a little amount and stuff like that but still regardless you you never want to be without water as such you know it's mm-hmm. a natural resource but i do understand where you're coming from uh, on that issue and no you are correct we do not have any way of lowering pressure which i'm not sure why phil hogan said in the first place but regardless yeah, no. we there is no way to turn off water or turn it down to there is sorry there is a way to turn it off but there's no way to reduce the pressure as such yeah um, we will not we will not turn off the water and um, we can't well, can. do that to anybody because it's it's illegal as such it's in the yeah. constitution as you said yeah. Um, that, like I mean, Irish Water are lo- not looking to kind of cause any kind of problems here as regards to things. We're looking to do this as as transparently and as easy um, for the for the population as possible. You know. Okay. Um, I'm not sure if you if you have any more questions on that point. Um, but no, no, no. I, I, I have kind of given you as much information as I can here. That is the kind of maximum information that I have given yeah. the point of would say if someone doesn't want to pay their bill or something like that. I mean, it is yeah. their own choice at the end of the day. Yeah. No, no. Look, as I say, look, I have a, I have a sheet of paper here and it scribbles all over the place, and I, I've, I've more yeah. questions than I have. And I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I was fascinated by the whole subject. You know, um, the, yeah. the, 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 the only other observation I had was that we spent 120 million so far. Uh, setting up Irish water uh, via John Tierney, and I, I'm 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 fascinated that if they put 120 million into fixing the 41 percent leakage factor um, of something that's costing 1.2 billion, I'm working that out that it would drop the cost of producing water down to about 800 million, which is actually less than our surplus this year. So I'm confused. You know what I'm saying? I um, I you know, I, I, I'm, you know, I'm saying that there's a lot of scare tactics involved, you know, ensuring the future and so on and so on. That if you stop the leaks, that doesn't ensure the future. But have I any more questions for you, Robert? No, I don't. Um, no, I don't. I think you've actually asked some questions. Yeah, that's um, no problem, sir. I mean, okay. As I say, we are open 24-7. Um, you can give us a call at any stage if you do have any questions or, God forbid, any emergencies or something like that that you might have at home. We will try to get the issue rectified as soon as possible for yourself. Okay. Robert, you've been brilliant. I appreciate your time. No problem at all. Thanks very much. For Thank, you very much. Thank you very much. Have a good evening. Thanks for calling out of Okay. Same to you. Take care. Thanks, sir. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.